What's up guys, Baker here. This has got to be one of the most awesome tutorials you will ever see, unless uh, you're in PC. Um, because this one is about custom keyboard shortcuts, and why this is important is because for most Mac users, um, to set uh, markers, you need the numpad, the star on the numpad, and um, it's very annoying because we'd shift A doesn't work for us and uh, it's it sucks but uh, for those of you that know I'm on a little MacBook check this out what is that are those markers oh my gosh it is alright here's what we did I found a script file online and I will provide the link for download and you can put this anywhere, you don't have to import it or anything. But um, go to File, Scripts, Run Script File, find your file, it's called Keyed Up. Go ahead and open that. And uh, this should work, I'm not positive, but this should work for all After Effects. And uh, basically, you just need to find your shortcut that you want to change and just assign it a new shortcut. So. Uh, if you specifically want markers, you're going to need to go to previewing, preview, I did a work area, and um, I just changed it to shift period, I don't know, you just make something up, but um, what you need to be careful of is to make sure that this is not already assigned to something else, and here's an example, well, if I click this one, we have equal sign, all you do is uh, click show usage, and it says you can use this for uh, timeline zooming in or timeline zoom to current time. So if you want your keyboard uh, shortcut to work, like this one, shift period, you have to go to show usage and make sure it's not being used by any other thing. If it is, you can just go to that thing, you know, timeline something, go find it, and then just change it to unassigned. And then your new keyboard shortcut will work. And then for uh, markers, markers um nope it's got to be in uh, layer properties no layer where is it timeline layers add layer marker I change it to uh, slash just because it's right next to my period so um just gotta make sure you so oh my gosh show usage to make sure it's not assigned to anything else and then it works and then you just click OK now I'm not sure if you can revert it back to all your normal shortcuts so before you do anything make sure you go to save as and then save your shortcuts as something and then if you kinda mess up you can just reload it and it will go back to normal so anyways this is an awesome script and you just get to change your shortcuts uh, like I said it's probably just gonna be used for all you Mac users who always wanted to use markers but never could but um other than that, this is, like, awesome for everybody, I think. So go ahead and uh, leave, a, leave a comment if you have any questions. Uh, follow me on Facebook and Twitter for all that good stuff. And leave a like, favorite, share, whatever. Hope you guys enjoy. Peace.